it's a little haphazard back there, but as I was saying, so with Dometic Go, it was really important to have everything fit in the back of your car, ready to go at a moment's notice. So instead of making some products, coming out with a new product that you can go, oh, I can throw it in the back, it'll fit, they actually went through and looked at about 45 different car trunks, boots, however you want to call it, to kind of look at what the average size is with that and kind of get a good idea of what that space parameter is in your kind of average vehicle. So from there, once they had that idea, they went ahead and, and made the products to fit specifically. So as you can see here, we've got a lot of the different things in here. Um, and it's gotten a little haphazard. Um, but you've got the hard storage, you've got your, your folded down table, that's the size of the folded down table. As I was saying, the water cooler or the, the water storage unit is meant to fit perfectly right there in that weird little space by the wheel well. Oh, yeah. All that. So there, there's been a lot of care, a lot of thought, and a lot of kind of engineering going in to make sure all of these new products in Dometic Go actually fit in the back of you know your car and things like that. So some of the things we didn't get a chance to take a look at, first of which is a new camp chair. Camp chairs are camp chairs. What they wanted to really do with this is make a really aesthetically pleasing camp chair that's as at home at your campsite as it is being able to pull it out and put it out on your patio. So as you can see, and with a lot of the things, they've gone with a brushed aluminum on there that's kind of reminiscent of like a MacBook, so it's that really nice satiny aluminum finish. Got some wood accents on here, really comfortable canvas seating area. Um, Again, it's, it works awesome as a camp chair, but I'm excited to put this out on my patio when I need extra seating for people because it's a really great looking chair. So to also address kind of that ownership part of, of a chair, it's like my chair. It's not, a, it's not a seating arrangement for a couple of people. They've come out with a two-person camp bed that when packed down is about that big around and about two end-on-end -end nail jean bottles. It's a really great shareable seat as opposed to you know what a chair is. So you've yeah. got a two-person, works great here at the table. So you can put one on either side. You've got almost a picnic table, put a couple chairs at the end of it, you've got seating for six. The other nice thing is the personal camp heater. So it fits the footprint of the chair. It can obviously be used anywhere, but it's made to fit the footprint of that. Also fits the footprint of the camp bench perfectly. You've got three different settings on here, three different levels of warmth on there. It's powered. That one doesn't have the cords in it. I can go with it anyway. No, I can't. I need to find a different one. Sorry. I want to be able to show you. Can you see like a Yeah. Thank you. Uh, I'll, I'll text you if I, if I make it down tomorrow. Sounds good. Nice to meet you. Yeah, absolutely. All right, so the, the back to the camp heater. You got three levels of warmth on there. You've got a nice handy pouch that's already attached to it that has all your cables with it. You can go ahead and attach that via USB to any sort of power bank or power source on that. Auto shuts off after 60 minutes, so you don't have to worry about killing your battery. But it also comes with, in case you've got an older car, and want a heated seat, you can plug that right into your cigarette lighter and you've got a heated seat. The other nice thing about it is if you have an external battery like the PLB40, it's got the two-pin system, locking two-pin as well, so it screws in there so you don't have to worry about it pulling out, but the two-pin system there to power it as well. And again, really nice to just have that pouch on there so you've always got your cords, everything right there on your personal heater. Boom. Side by side, cold winter's night, checking out the stars, you've got a camp heater. Also, I am super excited to use this as a sleeping bag warmer, a little pre-warmer for a sleeping bag. Um, again, it's got an hour law, or it's got, shuts off after an hour, so you don't need to worry about burning up your battery, getting the bag too hot. Another thing new with the Dometic Go, and I mentioned a little bit, is the table. We've got a really nice bamboo surface on there. And if you notice the legs, the legs, they've gone, tried to go as, as close to vertical as they can, again, to make it so you've got ample leg room if you set up a couple of benches. There's also three heights to this, so you can have it at a coffee table size, 
a little bit higher for like a nice little kids table or pull it up to the full extension to have like a full on dining table at your campsite. All of this folds down, it folds in half, and this is the footprint of it packed up in the back of your car. All in that tiny little spot right there. Oh, it's amazing. Perfect camp table. Um, as, I sh as I showed you with the, the pucks that come with the, um, with the water faucet. Yes. Also made perfectly to fit right there, so you can set your water jug right underneath the table, and you've got pretty much a water faucet right here on the end of your oh camp goodness. table. So good. Too. Yeah. Yeah. So, on to some lighting as well. So as you can see up here, they also have the LED string lights. Those can be paired with this to do whatever color that you want. But then we've got a nice little camp lamp here, held on magnetically at the top. So you've got the diffuser on there for a nice little, nice little lamp. It can come, up, come off there for a little handheld. It comes preset with eight different colors. You've got red, green, blue, a yellow, a purple. And then you have your clear white light. But what's really exciting is this color here. So this kind of amber color right there. Really interesting thing about that color, it does not repel bugs, but bugs are not attracted to that wavelength of color. So, and Reed could actually show you a video that he has of being out with one of these on the white light, and this on this, end to end on a big table. There's hundreds of bugs around this one. Pans over, there's nothing around this one. They can't see it. So setting this on your table at night when you want to sit around and just chat with everybody, it doesn't repel, again, it doesn't repel them, sure. but they can't see it, so they're not gonna flock to it. Wow, so, I did not know this, this is cool. Yeah, it's really, really amazing. It has something to do with the wavelength. Yeah, I'm sure you And they can't see it, yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. But a really nice little camp light. Um, can also, because of its, it's got the USB on there, so it can also be used as a small um, battery bank, power bank if you need it to. So there we go. And then I think, I think I've gone through everything and trying to, we went out of order. Oh, one last thing. So we've got the camp blanket, which is really awesome because not only is it big, and you can wrap it around you, you've got two sides on here. It's the nice, kind of soft, fluffy side, and then you've got the other side that's waterproof, windproof, everything else. The footprint of that, as well, is really big, so you can pretty much make your own personal base camp wherever you need it. Throw this down with that side down, it's gonna be protected from the elements. It's also just really nice as a two-person on the, on the seat there. It's a little drizzly, a little misty, drape it over for warmth, and you're protected from the elements on this side of it. Wow. All folds up into a nice, tight little package as well. That's fantastic. Yeah. Yeah. So there, I think we have it. I think I got everything for you. <laughs> 13, technically 15. 15 new products, all debuting, um, available in March of 2022, all part of the Dometic Go line, and um, yeah, everything you need for a couple days of adventure all fit perfectly in the trunk of your car. Fantastic, Kevin. Yeah. That's freaking awesome. Yeah. yeah that's awesome. Super.